cardiac segment surgeon, corneal transplant surgeon in uh, Delhi. And I've been uh, practicing here for the past 10 years now. This video is being recorded for uh, to share my experiences regarding the IQL picking IOL which I've been using now for the past 8 to 9 years. So first of all, I must say this lens is a good quality lens. And this is not because this video has been recorded. Each one of my patients in whom I've been using this lens is very happy. The primary indication of using this lens is patients who are unfit for LASIK or patients who have higher refractive errors of more than uh, minus 8 or 9. And this lens comes into the, uh, comes up to the tune of minus 23. And I have myself implanted a lens of minus 21 adapters and, and the results on day 1 are exceedingly well, exceedingly good. The patients, the satisfaction level of the patients is very good. It is a very easy lens to implant. It goes in through a 3.2 incision. I always, uh, I do almost all of my surgeries under topical anesthesia. It takes about only 4 to 5 minutes to do the surgery for one eye. Do it at a two separate intervals, 3 days apart. The wow factor which this lens gives you is much, much, much more than that the patient gets after LASIK surgery. By saying this, by no means I am telling you that you should not do a LASIK in patient who is fit for LASIK. But when, a, when the patient is unfit, unfit for LASIK, there should be no hesitation of you going and performing a IQL FICIC uh, intraocular lens. The quality of the lens is very good. It is very much malleable, goes through a very small incision. It's reversible surgery, easy to explant a lens if, if the case be. Although I haven't yet expanded a lens because it, there has been no incidence of me requiring, requiring to explant a lens. But the lens is very good. So I must here say that uh, you, know, you should be very... Uh, I would, I would encourage you to put this, this lens uh, in all of your patients who are having minus errors, high, high refractive errors because the life of a, refract, um, a high myopia is very miserable. It's only through those glasses and once you get, to get, get those glasses removed, even if there is, even if there is no perceptive uh, quantity improvement, there is a huge quality and field improvement which the patient perceives. So even if the patient is happy wearing glasses, if the number is more than 5, 6, 7 or 8, I would strongly, strongly encourage and I always do that in my patients to get the glasses removed and uh, for that this Fekir IOL, uh, IQ Fekir IOL is a very good option.